The so-called Nuremberg Laws of Nazi Germany were anti-Semitic and racial laws enacted to restrict the rights of German Jews and to keep Aryan blood pure. There was no actual practical value to these laws and they did measurable harm to the German economy. But Hitler's obsessive hatred of the Jews was real and the Nuremberg Laws were an extension of that hate. About a third of Germans despised the Jews as well and most of the rest of the population was too terrified to complain. Fortunately in America, the writing and promulgation of laws is the job of the United States Congress, a body that is currently controlled partly by the Democrats. So no equivalent of the Nuremberg Laws is currently under contemplation. But that doesn't stop Donald Trump's obsessive personal hatred of Mexican and Central American immigrants and foreigners from being transformed into national policy by way of executive order and internal decree. In classic petty, Little man fashion, Trump has acknowledged planning to free immigration detainees in Democratic urban strongholds as a ploy to exact political retaliation against the Democrats. On Friday Trump tweeted, due to the fact that Democrats are unwilling to change our very dangerous immigration laws, we are indeed, as reported, giving strong considerations to placing illegal immigrants in sanctuary cities only. The radical left always seems to have an open borders, open arms policy, so this should make them very happy. Unlike Trump and the shivering cowards who hide in his shadow, the people of sanctuary cities welcome newcomers both foreign and domestic. The notion that they are all composed of rapists, murderers and drug dealers is a bogeyman exclusively populating the demon-haunted world of Donald Trump and the few who are stupid enough to still believe in him. Trump, who according to a 1990 Vanity Fair article owned a book of Adolf Hitler's speeches and kept it in his bedside cabinet, clearly admires Hitler and wishes he could do to immigrants what Hitler did to the Jews. His re-embrace of zero tolerance at the border as policy and reinstitution of the separation of immigrant children from their parents is only the beginning.